What makes America great? Freedom, free speech, free will. We're the land of the free and we're keeping it free. Land of the Free Shipping starts for Buyers Club members September 4th of 2019. See you there. What's up guys? It's American Gun Chick and it's Gun Day Monday. Jacksonville, Florida. Where emblazoned on the police cruisers is the bold new city of the South. As in all cities, Jacksonville has its beautiful areas and amazing history of hardworking blue collar Americans. But in many spots, it also has its big city issues, most recent and notably. This breaking news out of Florida, shots ring out at a riverfront mall in Jacksonville, leaving four people dead and many more injured. This all happened inside of a restaurant where a video game tournament was taking place. NBC's Dan Sheneman has the latest. Competitors flock to Jacksonville to play an NFL video game. In the middle of the live streaming competition, the shooting started. Authorities converged on the scene, an entertainment complex along the city's riverfront, and blocked off the area. Not far from the scene, we enlisted the help of our good friend Rod Mills of Scorched Earth Firearms Training. My name is Rod Mills. I own a company called Scorched Earth Firearms Training. I grew up in Jacksonville, Florida. I grew up in what they would say the hood. You know, growing up, you know, in the hood, you learn a lot of uh, the school of hard knocks and you learn some of the, the ways of the street, uh, which propelled me to, to get out of that and go to college and, uh, you know, get a degree and uh, make a better life for myself. Uh, a lot of people look at me and they say, well, man, you know, you must be uh, a Republican. I say, no, I'm not a Republican. And they say, well, you must be a Democrat. I'm like, no, nope, I'm not a Democrat either. I'm just an American. I'm just me. And I just want to be able to teach them how to shoot correctly, uh, that they are safe when they leave my class and that they have fun. Those are the only two requirements I have. Supporting us this week in Orange Park, Florida, is On Target Sports, where shoot happens here. On Target Sports has an array of tactical gear. They are a class three dealer, host classes, and have two separate indoor ranges. Today we will be introducing you to our students and also hosting our classroom session here. Supplying the ammo for this week's class is Liberty Ammunition, Proud makers of the Liberty Ammo Civil Defense Round. The round is a 50 grain, 2,000 feet per second projectile, sure to get you the results you are looking for. Shout out to Liberty Ammo. Now, let's introduce you to the students. My name is Missy. My occupation is in-home care, and I'm married with four wonderful children. Missy also brought her mother to the class. Diane. I'm Diane Singley. I work at Wawa. I want to make sure I know what I'm doing before I do anything with a gun or anything. I mean, I've shot guns before. I've been at Targets or I've been outside for back home where I'm from. We go to the woods and shoot, but I haven't shot anything probably in 20 something years. The third student joining us is a girl I met just the night prior. So I'm Melanie Garcia, I'm 26 years old, and I just moved to Jacksonville. I have no experience with guns. I know nothing, I don't know any names, how to hold them, I don't know the stance, and I would just like to learn how to protect myself because my husband is military, so unfortunately when he's gone I am alone, and. Gosh forbid something happens, I'd rather know how to protect myself and others around me. My name is Eric Garcia and my wife is Melanie Garcia. I've been trying to get my wife to shoot for about three years now and no luck. <laughs> I just thought it would be a good idea to start learning how to be more comfortable with a gun. One of the things we asked the ladies is if they've ever owned guns or had past experiences with guns. I've come close to shooting my ex-husband one time because he wouldn't answer me when he came in the house. <laughs> Past experience, I've actually had one gun pulled to my head before. Um, I was very terrified. I was a teenager and all. 
And ever since then, I've just always been curious, wanted to learn more about them, just in case something like that occurred again, I can be able to defend myself. I was scared. I was very terrified. Helpless. Yeah, I was helpless. Didn't, you know, I was in a neighborhood and didn't know where I was at or anything like that. I was with friends of ours and they stopped on the side of the road and was going into the house. And next thing you know, guns to my head. The next thing we asked is what did they hope to achieve in this class? I'm um, hoping to achieve to, like I said, be more comfortable with the gun. You know, bullet gets jammed in the chamber. I need to know how to get that out because my husband's not always going to be there. I've been pretty much safety to make sure I don't shoot somebody that I don't need to. I'm just not comfortable with them and I feel like that's something that I should change. And you can't always YouTube how to do a gun. <laughs> I'm sorry, but you just can't. You know, you really need hands on to learn it further than, you know, your grandfather and your dad, your pop. This should be totally clear where your eyes focus totally on this. So if they're We close the class with some sight alignment sight picture and dry fire training. Can you give me one word that explains, just one word that explains how you're feeling right now? I'm excited. I'm excited to learn. Nervous. <laughs> <laughs> That's the way I can tell you. Nervous. <laughs> That's how I feel right now. But I'm excited too. One word that explains me exactly how you're feeling right now. Happy. Comment Sportsman's Guide below and let them know what you think of this series. Sportsman's Guide is land of the free shipping when you're in the Buyers Club. Also, check out Just Holster It for all your holster needs. Now give us a thumbs up and comment Sportsman's Guide.